Welcome back to my channel. We are now starting a journey of learning Python together, as I promised. But before that, we need to understand what is programming and why Python. For that, I've created a, uh, a PowerPoint slideshow to um, show you what that means. So I'm going to just play it now. We need to understand what programming is. We as people, we talk in languages um, such as English, Spanish, German, Japanese, Hindi. A computer does not understand these languages. So we have to write programs for computer to understand. And these programs have to be written in a programming language. This programming language can be Python, can be C sharp, can be C, can be Java, any programming language. So programming is basically writing or creating a set of instructions that tell a computer how to perform a particular task. So when we write a code, we tell the computer that this is what I want to do. Whether it's moving a piece of um, cube on the, on the screen or whether it's moving the player, whether it's just multiplying, whether it's getting a remainder, those sort of things. But we need to specifically tell the computer in a programming language what it needs to do. Now the source code of a program is written in a language comprehensible by the program, by the programmer, and is directly executed by central processing unit in a computer. So we write the code in a language similar to English language. And then that program is processed by a central processing unit in a computer in machine code. The programming language allows programmer to write coding in a language similar to spoken or written language, not in machine code. So that's basically just writing code in a, a spoken or written language or very similar sort of syntax. And we don't have to write in 010101, which is machine code. Top programming languages of 2021. So according to GitHub, JavaScript, Python, Java won top three spots in popularity of the programming languages around the world in third quarter of 2021. So Python is among the top most languages right now. Python, what's the name? Well, Python was created by Guido Van Rossen. And Python is actually named after Monty Python's Flying Circus, which was a show on BBC, not the actual reptile Python. Why Python? There's many, many programming languages right now, but why should I learn Python? That's a big question. So to answer that, Python has a very simplified syntax, which makes it very readable. When you write code in, in Python language, it's pretty much like writing in English. Yes, there's obviously not full English language, not all the abbreviations and all, but um, you will see that it's very similar and it's very readable. Python itself is very versatile with multiple users. Python is used in data mining, data science, artificial intelligence, machine learning, web development, web frameworks, embedded systems, gaming, product development, automation scripting, and the list goes on. So Python is very, very versatile and is very strong language as well. It's a very high level language. Python has an incredible, incredibly supported community. So it's very easy to find support for Python because there's a supportive community and you can easily find information about Python. Also, there's a lot of libraries that you can find. Python is in high demand for jobs 
So if you if you want to work as a programmer, Python can be the first language and it's in very high demand for jobs. And as good of when Rossum actually said, Python is now the language of MHAs and I mean that in the best possible way. So yes, an amateur can actually learn this language and it can be a starting point. Python is used by these companies. Intel, IBM, NASA, Netflix, Facebook, Spotify. Basically anything which is running a video has a bit of Python involved in it. I'm not saying all websites, but I would say majority of them. So guys, as you now know what Python is and why should we learn Python, um, I will be seeing you in the next videos where we'll be creating projects starting from the basic project called Hello World, which we create in any programming language. And don't forget, don't forget to uh, like, share, subscribe, and comment on these videos. You can also tell me what you would like to learn. Thank you.